Hi, I'm John DeWally, Director of the Witzel Alternative Programs for the Melville School District. The Witzel Alternative Programs is comprised of the Freshman Academy, the Alt Academy, the Virtual Academy, and the Homeschool Academy. We offer students an opportunity to be successful in a non-traditional setting. We welcome all types of students here at Witzel. Some students have not been successful, some are looking for something different. We want to set up a system in which these students can be successful. I believe the true key to our success is the relationships built in our classrooms. ALT is for everyone. Uh, I think a lot of people think that there's a specific type of student, but every student is completely different and has a different reason why they're being here. Um, a lot of them just like a smaller setting, which I've talked about, um, but some of them really need um, extra academic help. Um, some of them really just like working on the computer and it just works for them and they want to work independently. Some of them can get really far ahead in their classes while others can kind of go a more slow pace that they need and get that extra help. I just started this year. You just log on and you can work at your own pace in the classes that you want to work on for the day and you're not rushed or slowed down by other people. You can work here at school and then when you go home you can work online and get ahead in your classes. Are you ahead? Yes. <laughs> I'm almost done with my semester one classes. The classroom settings are a lot smaller. Um, my first class I have 12 and my second class I have nine students. Uh, I can work with them while they all work independently on the computer. My principal in middle school was allowed to sign up, I think he said 12 students, and I was one of the students he chose. He said that it's for students who don't function well in a normal classroom setting, which I found odd, but kind of agreed with. So I am not a normal kid. I'm awesome. I love alt. So last year when I got here, I was the only girl in my classroom. Like literally, I was the only girl in there. And it freaked me out because there was like 11 boys and one girl. And then um, a girl from Oakville transferred and she turned out to be my best friend. At Melville, I have more than one teacher. And here, I technically only have one teacher, but it's more than. But to me, it's more than one because each of the teachers that work here know a certain subject, and it's all of the subjects that are on our uh, E2020 program. So, like, I'm terrible at math. So if I need help, I'd go down the hallway to Miss Widmer and ask her to help me with like a test or a quiz or something. I think I get better grades than I, uh, than I probably would have if I would have stayed at Melville because I wasn't the best student, but that was because. I tend to get distracted easily. We have had 200 students graduate that have been connected with this program, about 50 last year alone. Although many of our students identify with being alt students, it is important to remember that they are students from Melville and Oakville High School. He's been here, well, a year and a half. And uh, what happened was he wasn't doing too good in school uh, with the, the social environment, it's kind of distracting. And so they told me, my neighbor told me about the program because uh, her son was in it. and. Uh, he, his grades shot up, and then the last semester of last year, I don't know what happened, he did a whole 360, grades start coming up. This year he's been doing good, good grades. First honor roll in years, when I, I mean probably middle school, I don't even, I mean grade school, I don't even remember the last time he had an honor roll. So, I was really impressed. Where I'm at, from where I'm living at, it's kind of hard. Not a lot of people make it out of there. It's more of like, it's very bad, but at the same time though, my parents want the best for me. My mom and dad felt like this would be a good thing for me. Felt like this was a big change for me and uh, I could do well in this. And from what happened uh, last year, I felt like I was doing pretty good, so I decided to take another year of it. I'm not like more of a writing type of person, so when it comes to uh, old school, I can be very virtual with it, like the online lectures and all that, it helps me out a lot. I play baseball, basketball, and football, and all year round, so that's pretty much saying that I can do old school, even when I'm after practice, if I got if I got in there at home, I do I do homework there. After practice, if I have time before I get on the bus, I still do work at school. It's just the environment it makes me feel very safe around here. Like I know that I could come here, get my work done. I could still have fun while doing it. I got a lot of friends I could talk to. In my opinion, this is one of the most important programs our district has. This program helps kids that otherwise may not make it.